Hello, young artist. Okay, we're going to connect with um, the word con collector again. And this time we're using words to kind of create a design. Um, so I'm going to demonstrate that for you. The first step is you want your paper to be square, if you can, in size. You want to fold halfway up, and then you want to fold again halfway up. And so it'll give you three pretty equal sections. You want to pick a three-letter word, and you want to write that three-letter word the same way. So I'm going to pick the three-letter word of fun. You can see how I'm spacing out my letters and I'm using that entire space. I'm connecting my letters, so I connected the N. I'm connecting the U. I'm connecting the F. Same thing again. Connect the F. Broke my point. Connect the U. And then connect the N. So that starts to give you that designy, fun quality. I'm going to take my black marker and I'm going to trace. You can also use a black crayon. So I'm going to trace all my letters. And I... I want them to kind of be exactly the same to um, give you that design look. And I can still do some more connecting. The connecting of the letters is important in this project. And here we go one more time. And I'm done with that part. I'm gonna use my black crayon or my black marker again, and I'm going to edge the entire paper. Again, creating that connection, making sure that my letters are connecting, that they're touching, at least in some of the areas. So I'm going around and I'm creating that edge, that connection. Okay, now I'm gonna pick a bold color. It could be the plum that I used before, or it could be something even brighter, like um, you could use orange, like an orange crayon or an orange marker. I think I'm gonna use an orange marker and I'm just going to start to fill in my negative space with that orange marker. And it's gonna have a real nice design feel when I am all done. So I decided to use a fun color of orange and just like um, when you use crayons, it's nice to trace the area and then fill, you know, trace it and then carefully fill. Same thing, trace the area and fill it in. And I'm going to trace this area and fill. And trace this area and fill. And my last area, trace and fill. So there it is. I've completed my art lesson connecting with the book titled The Word Collector and I created a design using words. Have fun.